Having finalised my report for the Landmark Trust, we started to discuss about how the works would progress. So at that point, uh, I introduced Mike Reevely, who, uh, who is the um, contractor for Reevely Ceramics, uh, and he um, undertook the work. He uh, commissioned new tiles, and they have turned out absolutely spot on and they match almost perfectly with the original tiling. Um, they obviously look a little cleaner, <laughs> but uh, they will blend in perfectly. Um, in terms of uh, conservation work, the basic principle is to try and retain as much of the original material as possible, original tiling as possible. Um, obviously where tiles are completely broken and smashed, which was the case with this floor, um, for practical purposes you have to replace with replicas. Um, it's got to be a functioning floor at the end of the day, people have to walk across it, it has to be cleaned, etc, uh, etc. Et Initially we pre-lay the, pre the tiles check that everything fits. We then remove them and then put down some adhesive in order to, for the tiles to be set. Um, you'll see Alex doing this. Alex is, um, has, start, has been with me for now about five years um, and he's come on and learnt the skills. Um, in, I um, intentionally try and uh, decided that we need to develop these skills in young people so that the, um, <clears throat> the, the ability to do this sort of work can continue. Uh, it's quite a skillful business. It has to be, it takes quite time to learn. Alex started by laying a bed of adhesive. He'll now start putting in the tiles. Uh, the tiles are um, of different heights. Uh, older tiles are a lot thicker than the, um, than the reclaimed tiles. So there has to be, um, in order to get a flat level surface, different amounts of adhesive are placed in uh, to build up the level of <laughs> the tile and then they're pressed in just to make sure they runs smoothly with the rest of the floor. Uh, when we were taking up the tiling uh, from the, all the damaged tiling, there were obviously tiles that came up that, which weren't damaged. Um, these we reclaimed for use to be put back on the floor. And uh, these are an example of the sort of uh, tiles that we've reclaimed. Um, while we've got the closure going on, we're taking full advantage of the time. So we're putting in a new shower, which is uh, more accessible. We're making an accessible gate at the end of the platform for our guests who, who need assistance in, in getting in and out of the property. And we've moved into the station master's house. We're making some rearrangements into the sitting room. So we've made this, we're making the sitting room into a bit of a comfortable library. And the sitting room area will be moving into the waiting room area so the floor the, the area that's getting the floor is going to be a comfortable area for families to sit uh, there's a there's a stove in there the, the dining room it's going to be a dining room stroke sitting room uh, with the kitchen and then we're redecorating everything from top to bottom so from the top of the station master's house to to the foot of the door in the waiting room everything's getting repainted so all in all it's um, a lot of items are going to get ticked off our maintenance list and making huge improvements to the building. Uh, unless you're an expert, I would, uh, I would challenge anyone to pick out new tiles from original tiles because the blend is uh, near perfect.